<laughs> All right, right side of the vehicle, 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 side of the Now it's in our lane. We got to do something. Whoa! A little rear tire slippity sloppity. Whew. All right, so we're riding. We're riding right here. A little crooked, you know, the camera angle. All right, as soon as you see that, as soon as that person crept out, it's like, hmm, intersection, orange stage, maybe you should be prepped and ready, and maybe I should just get off screen like this, and then, no, so be prepped and ready, guys. Be prepped and ready. Make sure you know what you're doing, okay? Uh, orange stage right here. So cover those brakes, get ready, understand progressive brake pressure, have all these skills already in place through parking lot practice. Uh, use the second channel, uh, motorcycle training concepts, uh, all on the bike stuff, practice. I do situation awareness in real time while riding in town. I also have parking lot practice, fun things to do. Uh, that way you have your fundamental skills. That's the whole thing about being a smart rider. Uh, seek out and recognizing si hazardous situations, which is right there, right? Intersection. So go into orange stage, uh, maintain your fundamental skills by going to the second channel, acquiring, utilizing personal protective equipment with the links in the description. We do have a bunch of resources for you, like Revzilla stuff. And then, you know, rescue other riders. we got accentscene.org, link in the description. Take an online class, get it, $5 off using code DDFM. And then teach and mentoring other riders. You know, take somebody under your little wing, right? You know, help them out a little bit. So right here, we're, we're, we're going to catch up to this, okay? We're going to catch up to this. There's nothing... If you just roll up the throttle, you're, you're the inertia of you rolling, you know, holding the clutch, you're just going to coast. You're still going to be faster than this person because that person went from zero, maybe zero, let's say five miles an hour to now having to get up to your speed. It's not going to happen that quickly. We're on motorcycles. We could do that. They can't. So in this situation, just go ahead and decelerate a little bit, you know, squeeze a little bit of that front brake, you know, squeeze, uh, press a little bit of that rear brake. But we're not doing progressive brake pressure. We're kind of just covering it. We're not doing anything because we're hoping that we don't have to do it. And I think a lot of new riders don't want to have to do any braking because they're not confident in their braking skills. They're not swerving because they're not confident in their swerving skills. Practice, practice, practice so that you know exactly what to do. Just don't assume that going out for a ride every day is going to get you the practice needed for these situations. You see that right there? So watch, he's going to fishtail just a little bit because he smashed that rear brake and lost traction on that tire. He released it, so then it grabbed traction again. He, now he's able to apply a little bit more brake pressure. So if you ever do have a problem and you start to fishtail it because you're applying way too much rear brake, go ahead and release that rear brake. But the problem is you still need to stop, so now reapply it when you have traction. So listen. You saw that? It's like... That right there is a little too much uh, rear brake, lost traction, started to fishtail. But the problem is we still need to slow down because we have this car right here. So what do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Well, it looks like this car is giving us an out just in case. I don't want to take it because I don't trust that this car is not going to go over uh, and take up the whole lane. So I still need to stop or slow down in time. So I just need to match this person's speed with my deceleration. That's what I have to do. That's all I have to do. So just apply a little bit front brake. We're not even applying anything yet. Okay, apply some front brake. We're not, no, we're doing the opposite. No. Make sure you guys practice your skills. Go to a parking lot. Practice, 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 practice. Okay, my ebook is is pretty much on sale if you sign up on Patreon and you sign up for the motorcycle gear giveaway as tier one. You're going to get the ebook for $15 and get entered to win over $800 in motorcycle gear from Revzilla. So, guys, just, just do it. Just do it.